Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Is this your Ferrari? Yeah, it is. What do you do for living out in Houston, Texas to be able to afford a Ferrari? I'm an entrepreneur. And how long have you been a business owner for? 21 years. And what type of business do you run? I own a uh, labor force management company. How important was it for you learning how to master delegation? Let's put it this way. How important is it? My company will do $300 million this year in revenue, right? If I were still doing it all myself, we might do three. And have you ever been broke before? <laughs> I think every entrepreneur has been broke before, 100%. There was a point in time, I'll never forget this, I'd actually made about $3 million a year. I think I was 28 years old. Every dollar that I made had to stay in the company, but yet I had to pay income taxes on that money. So I owed like $950,000 income taxes on that money, and I had like $10,000 in the bank. You can make a lot of money as an entrepreneur on paper and be broke financially, personally, because every dollar that you're making, if you're doing the right thing, has got to stay in that company to be able to grow it. It takes money to make money, like I said. How did you get the money to start your business? Like, did you have a lot of money when you started no, no, we had no money. So you have to beg, borrow, and steal when you're starting it out. We had to take out high interest loans. Uh, I call it loan shark money back then. But I'm actually really glad I did it that way. I started out that way and I had to pay those absurd interest rates because it forced me to have the discipline to not take the money out of the business. Now you can go to a bank, get a traditional line of credit at 6 or 8%, whatever's going on. And now you go from 21% interest on your capital needs to 6 or 8. You've probably got an extra $20,000, $25,000 a month right back to your bottom line. You know they don't teach that in school, right? No, they don't teach any of this in school. That's the problem. Thank you so much for your time. My pleasure, man.